Using the logo press 3 standard component library, I will insert two pierce punches along with their die buttons. I can use the logo press filters to hide and show various combinations of the different sub-assemblies. Then can select a different supplier. Body diameter for the punch. Point length. The point the point diameter has already been selected. I can choose a different component for the die button. I can select a diameter for the die button and a length. Enter the die clearance. Under auto plates cross through, I can choose to put clearance in other plates such as slug clearance in the shoe. Select a standard drill size for that slug clearance. Once I've set the parameters, I check OK. Puts me into positioning sketch, two points are already placed. I exit the sketch and the punches and the die buttons and the associate holes are inserted into the tool.